In today's video, I'm gonna show you how I set up the lean-to with an awning. Super simple. Uh, I have my helper here, my daughter. Uh, she's been doing some bluegill fishing. She wants a video credit for this, so I'm gonna put a little picture or video of her right here. You got it? Okay, now she's terrified of the cicadas. It's cicada season. It's the 17 year cicada broad X season. There are thousands of them. Hopefully you can hear me all right. I already have the ridge line set up. Yep, my dad is right. Um, if you want to see more about this ridge line, I have a video called the ready made ridge line, which you can go check out. Super simple how to how to set one of these up and tie it. Um, so let's get started. Okay. So I have the AquaCast uh, guide series tarp that I'm gonna use for this. It's a 10 by 10. If you've watched this video, you know that by now. So we're gonna get this put up over here, over the ridge line, and get it attached to the Prusik loops. We got my little assistant here. She's holding our toggles. Yep. And you wanna hold our bag? Thank you. <laughs> Bless you. Just need to find the... Okay, we're going to take it over the ridge line. And we're going to align it with the second tie out on each side of the front. This will be our awning section, the second tie out. And I'm going to need my assistant for this one. Hopefully I created enough room to get this tight enough. Okay, assistant, can I have a wooden toggle, please? Just one, thank you. Okay, now we're going to take the end of our loop on the second tie out, put it through the Prusik, and insert the toggle. Hopefully this toggle is not too thick to fit in there. No, nah, it's fine. Okay, now that we have our toggle on this side, we're gonna to move to this side and do the same thing. My little assistant could bring me my other toggle. Right here. <laughs> Thank you. And we're gonna take this, this end here and place it through the Prusik loop. Insert our toggle. You can use the tent stake as well. I just have toggles laying here from the last time, last video. Okay, I'm gonna pull this tight so that this is super tight. Check this side. Okay, now this will be our awning and we will stake out the back. So I'm gonna get some stakes and I'll be right back. Or we'll be right back. Okay, we're here at the back of the shelter and all we need to do is stake out two stakes here in the corners. So let's do the first one. And if my lovely assistant will give me a stake here. There you go. And you're gonna wanna pull that tight, as tight as you can get it. And stake it in. Okay, move to the other side and do the same thing. And stake, please. There you go. Pull that really tight. And stake it in. 
Okay, now that we got the back staked in, we're gonna move to the front and set up the awning, okay? Okay. Okay, now that we've moved around to the front, I'm gonna show you how I attach the paracord and toggle to the corner before we stake it out. Assistant, can I have uh, the yellow cord in one hand? Thank you. Now I simply just tie the bowline on one side. Excuse the mess here. I just cut this cord. Now all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pass it through the, the corner loop, like so. And then take a bite and push through our bowline. Can I have the stick please? And then we're gonna place our stick right inside. And we're gonna pull that down tight against our corner just like so and then we're going to run it to the ground and stake it in so i'm going to readjust and we will show you that okay now all we simply do is just pull our paracord out uh, it does your angle can change you can have it slightly angled so we will do that find out where we want it place our stake Okay, actually it's not, I hit a rock. Okay. Okay, that's good. Now I'm just gonna simply do a taut line hitch. And that is two on the inside. One, two, three. One on the outside. Pull that tight, dress it up a little. And there we have the taut line, which is an adjustable hitch, so we can slide that and tighten it. And that's nice and tight, we'll move that out of the way. And now we'll go to the other side. Okay, just like we did on that side, I put place the toggle inside the bowline with the Marlin spike hitch on the corner, and we're gonna run it down and stake it out. Find where you want it. Take it in. Now, just like we did on that side, we're gonna use a um, taut line hitch. So we're gonna go one over, two on the inside, one on the outside, and we have our, our taut line hitch and we can adjust this if it slides around. I really like this hitch. Okay. Okay, now I'm going to do a walk around of the complete setup of the lean tube with an awning. I'll take you down here first. Show you the taut line hitch used in the stakes for the awning. Beautiful AquaQuest logo and our toggle with our bowling. Do a side view here. Walk around the back. Okay, that's the setup of the lean to with an awning. Uh, we have our ground sheet in here. We have our sleeping bag that we can easily fit two to three people in here easy. Uh, I did hang the Yuko in the center here. Uh, you can hang a battery operated one there as well. Uh, if it starts raining on you, you can hang it from your center ridge line with a piece of paracord. It should give you plenty of light. Uh, so that's it. We really hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. We appreciate it. We appreciate it. All right, thanks.